intralaminar nuclei. There are several small nuclear groups which lie or embedded within the white matter of the thalamus which is the internal medullary lamina of the thalamus. So these are mainly centromedian and parafascicular nuclei. We are not going to discuss about other small nuclei because which don't have a greater anatomical significance. So we are going to discuss mainly about these two things. Centromedian and parafascicular nuclei. The centromedian nucleus being the largest intralaminar nucleus in the humans. So these intralaminar nuclei receive ascending afferents from the brainstem reticular formation and also from the spinothalamic and trigeminothalamic systems. After receiving afferents from these areas, they project to widespread regions of the cerebral cortex and also to the caudate nucleus and putamen of the basal ganglia. These are the efferents from this nuclei. So the intralaminar nuclei are the part of mechanism for activation of the cerebral cortex, which means when they are stimulated, all for rhythm activity which is associated with the repose and sleep is disturbed and the electroencephalogram becomes desynchronized and the lesions of this particular intralaminar nuclei reduce the perception of pain and also the level of consciousness. These are nothing but the intralaminar nuclei.